What is up, YouTube? Okay, let me do this. Alright, this one is better. What is up, YouTube? Today we're going to be doing the top 10 worst spots. Why you guys can't see me? Top 10 worst cities in South Jersey. Alright, so yeah, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. We're on a roll to 40 subscribers. Alright. Let me turn my thing works because. Number, all right, guys, let's get to this. Number 10, Pleasantville. Pleasantville made number 10 for a reason. It's right over the river from Atlantic City, and it's basically a hood inside of Atlantic. I meant, like, not inside, but, like, the suburb. This place is awfully bad. The crime and the poverty is the worst thing about this city in South Jersey. In southern part of South Jersey. This is how this is not a good place to go to. You guys can probably get some good Mexican and Puerto Rican foods because there's a lot of those types of people here. But you guys are not. As you guys could come here like maybe once. But it's a bad city, so I don't recommend you coming here. This doesn't look too pleasant. So it's pleasant, Bill. It doesn't look too pleasant. But that's number 10. Number 9, Paulsboro. Okay, Paulsboro is not bad because it's ba it's a bad city because it um it's because of the poverty in the school district. The school district is a D minus. That's basically an F. That is not good. That's some of the worst in probably the whole entire New Jersey. From some city hoods, like even like a C plus or C minus is what you get, but not a D minus. That's just sad. Paulsboro school districts are terrible. And this doesn't look too inviting. Do you really want to go to a city that looks like this? But, as you can say, if you want to go here to be a sports player, you can do that. Because it's a lot of there's a lot of sports around here. But, that's all you're really going to get in Paulsboro. Sorry, I like the town, but it's... it's hood. But, yeah. Number 8, Lindenwald. Okay, so Lindenwald is the same thing, like... It's like the school district is here. It's terrible. It's a C minus. It's not as bad as Paulsboro's for school district. But this is not a nice town. It's a little, some parts of the town is okay. But it's not a good town in the general area. There's way better places like Cherry Hill or maybe even Collingswood or something. Or Haddonfield around here. But don't go to Lindenwall. This place is basically a bunch of trees, but a bunch of hood. So there's a lot of housing projects around here. No school. There's a bad school district. This one actually has a bad crime. My cousin lives in these houses right here. These are terrible. My brother also lives around here. So, yeah, this is a bad place to go. Don't go here. You have a 1 in 30 chance of being a victim of a crime. And people only make around twenty five to $30,000 a year here. So, don't go to Paulsboro. I mean, don't go to Lindenwall. Number 7, Salem. Okay, Salem is a city near Delaware. It is very hood. Like, does this look like a nice place that you really want to go to? Tell me, I want you guys to be honest in the comments or go to one of my other videos and say this. This is not an inviting place. The crime is this is definitely in the top 10 in New Jersey. It's like for South Jersey, it's like the second most crime place. So don't go to play, don't go to Salem. You guys can go here once. It's a downtown is pretty nice, but the rest of the area don't go to. Okay. Don't go here. But you guys, they have a lot of food options and shopping. You have Ella's Mama's Restaurant and Pizzeria, Sea Grave Steak and, and Submarine, and Salem Oak Diner. You have a lot of options around here. And not too far away is Delaware, so if you like to do stuff in Delaware, there you go. Number six, Vyland. Alright guys, Vyland is a city in 
Southern New Jersey, like all these cities are. Okay, statistically, this is a bad place. The